Good morning, Rich Rushforth here with your Saturday morning U.S. Senior Women's Open update as we get into moving day. Saturday, an exciting day over at Pine Needles. The first red numbers were posted at the U.S. Senior Women's Open Championship yesterday. At Pine Needles, the low score of the day came from Julie Inkster, two-time U.S. Women's Open champion. And once Julie Inkster finds her stroke, she is relentlessly tough. After her 68 combined with her 78 on Thursday, Inkster is tied for third two strokes behind our leader, Helen Alfredson. The Swede Alfredson had a 69 yesterday, two shots below par, totaled with her 75, puts her at two over for the championship and alone at the top of the leaderboard. Laura Davies, our defending champion, shot a 70 yesterday. That, along with her first round 75, puts her at three over, one stroke behind Alfredson. Lisa DiPaolo's 72, along with her 74 on Thursday, also puts her two strokes back with Julie Inkster at four over par. There are a group of five players on the leaderboard at five over three strokes back, and they include Jane Crafter, Barbara Moxness, Becky Iverson, Trish Johnson, and round one's leader, Danielle Amakapani. And today is moving day, so players like our hometown hero Donna Andrews, who improved on her 78 from Thursday to shoot 75 yesterday, puts her at 11 over. That's nine strokes off the pace, but her trajectory is definitely moving her in the right direction. It's going to be an exciting weekend. Donna's tea time, 10.39 a.m. as we go out in pairs off the first tee right on through the rest of the championship. An interesting statistic, five players have hit every fairway through the first two rounds, putting themselves in favorable position to hit approach shots into those pine needles sloping greens. Of those five players, four are in the top 22, led by Jane Crafter of Australia, who is tied for fifth. So hitting the fairways, very important. A good start to a good hole. Putting has to be razor sharp, however, on these Donald Ross greens. Go see for yourself. Park at Sandhills Community College. Free shuttle service over to Pine Needles is provided. If you are in the military or retired, you go for free and you bring a guest for free. A ticketed adult may bring children 18 and younger for free as well. And keep in mind, you can follow the tee times, the pairings, the scoring, the leaderboard will be posted, and any advisories that may pop up at their website, usga.org, usga.org. Very simple. They do a great job. I'm Rich Rushforth with the latest from the U.S. Senior Women's Open Championship at Pine Needles on Star 102.5. Did I miss again?